Hello everyone and welcome back to Bird Nerd. Today we are going to be continuing last week's video on bird moms. If you have not seen that video yet, check it out. You don't have to have watched it to understand this video, but still, who doesn't want to learn more about bird moms? In the last video, I made up awards for the moms, so I figured why not continue it in this video? Now, let's go learn about five more unique bird moms. Award number one, the tiniest eggs. As you probably could have guessed, hummingbirds get the award for the tiniest eggs. Hummingbirds are pretty much the smallest birds, so it would make sense for them to have the tiniest eggs of any wild bird. The average size for the majority of species is about the size of a jelly bean. Obviously, this varies with the size of the bird. Bigger hummingbirds lay bigger eggs, and smaller hummingbirds lay smaller eggs. In fact, the smallest hummingbird in the world, the bee hummingbird, is native to Cuba and only measures two and a quarter inches long. These birds only weigh two grams, which is less than a dime. Crazy, right? Now, I was talking about eggs, so let me blow your mind. In a nest about the size of a quarter, these birds lay coffee bean-sized eggs. Definitely the tiniest eggs. Award number two, the committed mom. Female mallards literally risk their lives for their young. Now, what do I mean by that? Well, once a female begins to incubate her eggs, the male's duties are done, and he departs, leaving the female by herself. For around 28 days, the female sits on her nest for approximately 23 hours daily, relying only on her camouflage and luck to avoid predators. In fact, several studies have shown that up to 30% of females did not survive the four weeks of incubation. Even after the eggs are hatched, the female still works diligently to protect her young and provide warmth for up to 30 days. That takes a lot of commitment. Award number three, the strong pair bond. Sometimes forming lifelong pair bonds, Carolina wrens work together to build nests, raise young, protect territory, forage, and sing. These birds like to stay together so they can often be seen in pairs. Award number four, the fastest mom. There are many species of birds with very short incubation times, but one of the quickest is the red-winged blackbird. With one of the fastest incubation times of all common North American birds, the red-winged blackbird's eggs can hatch after only 11 days of incubation. There are many other birds with short incubation times, so I will put a link in the description to a website with a list of the average incubation and nestling periods for common North American birds if you want to check it out and see how long your favorite bird takes. Award number five. It's a family effort. In my opinion, American crows are one of the coolest species of birds. They are just so intelligent. This is not exactly a bird mom, but I would say it's good parenting, so I added it in anyway. Building a nest and raising young takes a lot of work, and even though the male and female crow work together to accomplish this, sometimes their efforts fall short, and that is where their previous brood comes in. Sometimes, American crow breeding pairs will get assistance from helpers in building their nest as well as feeding their young. Pretty awesome! Well, that is all I have for you in this video. I hope you enjoyed learning even more about unique bird moms as much as I did. If you liked this video, please don't forget to leave a thumbs up, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you know when I release a new video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you next time on Bird Nerd.